uh, good day all uh, it's not uh, longer a news uh, the fracas between ASU and the federal government of Nigeria well, there was a controversial uh, judgment by the industrial court uh, asking the university don't to go back to school uh, open the universities so that students would learn but if you look at it critically uh, this judgment uh, clearly it's the handiwork uh, of the government uh, the government are the one that orchestrated uh, all the happenings in the industrial court uh, the manner in which the the case was swiftly handled and uh, judgment delivered you know uh, one begins to suspect especially the, the situation of Nigeria where we know uh, court cases linger for a long time uh, by implication uh, based on what uh, Chris Ingige the uh, Minister of Labor said they are going to uh, direct all uh, vice chancellors to uh, open the universities uh, uh, this means that uh, any any branch of ASU that refused to uh, uh, reopen the university uh, the federal government uh, the ministry of labor they will threaten them uh, of losing their job which i think uh, it's not a good thing for the federal government to threaten the university don't because the fact remains that uh, we don't have any uh, better hands more than the ones we have now in the university uh, though uh, the ASU have also um, sent their own uh, appeal uh, this judgment was uh, actually delivered by uh, Honorable Justice uh, Polycap Harman now who is Honorable Justice uh, Polycap Harman because clearly uh, he is uh, playing the cards of, of the government, uh, Mr. Chris Ingige, for example. So let's find out who is Haman. Honorable Justice Haman attended Nwakala Primary School in Wukari, local government of Taraba State, from 1979 to 1986. He also attended Government Day Secondary School Pataje in Taraba State. He graduated from University of Abuja with LLB Law in 1999. He was called to bar in 2001 after attending the Nigerian Law School Buari, Abuja. He performed his NYSC primary assignment with the now defunct state and local government affairs. He started his working career in 2003 at a law firm of Suleiman Abdel Kader, son he later joined the Federal Ministry of Justice in Abuja in 2005 as a state consul and rose through the ranks to the post of Chief State Consul. While in the Federal Ministry of Justice, he served as the prosecutor in the Department of Public Prosecution DPP, and also as a counsel to the Census Tribunal National Population Commission. He was assistant legal advisor office of the head of civil service of the federation.